I'm the uh, curator of the fish collection at the Florida Museum of Natural History and my uh, research at the moment is primarily directed toward what we call a planetary biodiversity inventory of the freshwater fishes. The collection of fishes at the Florida Museum of Natural History is one of the five largest in the world. There are about 2.2 million specimens in the collection and of the 30,000 species known from the world, 8,000 are represented in our collection. Our inventory, I think, is a particularly interesting and important research topic because you can't really understand what's going on in any situation unless you understand who the players are. And for aquatic ecosystems, of course, uh, the primary players, if you will, or the components, are the fishes. Here in North Florida, where we're standing right now, we, we know what the species are. We don't always know what they're doing ecologically or behaviorally. But elsewhere in the world, we really don't know even what species are present. So the inventory is an attempt to change that. When we're in a fairly large body of water like this, we would use large nets, seines, take them out into the water, uh, drag down a few meters and then over to the bank, and then take the fish out, work with them, go back in the water and do it again. We take tissues from them so we can do DNA sequence analysis. We take photographs of uh, specimens that we're, we might perhaps use in a publication or put the images online. And then we preserve them and they're then put in the permanent collection where they can be studied by us and by other scientists. Thank you.